an absolute masterpiece from the uh, Mashamba West Mine in the Katanga. Uh, Size-wise, we're looking at a little bit bigger than a palm size. So if you have the guy standing, standing flat on a matrix like this, solid dolomite matrix, we'd have this effect looking across it. Minor crystallization on the edges. And then looking from the top down, we have a lawn of perhaps some tiny calcite crystals and perched on those are these pretty large for the species, diaptase crystals, which are first encountered here in November 2022. It's now February 2023 and still these guys don't fail to uh, uh, fascinate me. Now one of the things of our hobby is always the, the, the need for color and a lot of minerals are brown or dark in appearance. This is actually perfectly what one could need. Emerald green, of course the name diaptase meaning imitation emerald. Some even call diaptase uh, uh, copper emerald all the way from the Mashamba West Mine, a mine more famous typically for um, the, the lovely red cuprats of the Congo. And of course a product of expensive deep mining. And what's sad is when the mine hits sections like this where there's a lot of dolomite, they'd, they'd move mining in a different direction. Remember it's a very expensive process and they're mining for copper, cobalt and related. So they don't want pretty specimens. They're actually looking for so many grams of the ore they're mining for per ton. Bit of greenishness inside there as well, maybe traces of malachite.